kids' educational games. What? Hello. I'm Oscar the Oak Tree. And just like you, I'm living. Leaves. I love my leaves. They help me make food from the sun and water, and they help me breathe. Bark. Bark is like the skin of a tree. My bark is strong and stops me from getting hurt. Roots. My roots go deep into the ground and stop me from falling over in stormy weather. Sun. I need the sun on my leaves to help me grow. Care and attention. When I was young, I needed looking after. Water. I need water. My roots take up water from the soil. Well done. Find the six things I need to keep healthy. Bark. Hat. Care and attention. Bed. Leaves. Roots. Sun. Soap. Potatoes. Water. Bark. Care and attention. Leaves. Roots. Sun. Water. Well done. What an amazing sight, the wonders of forest life. A living world of plants and flowers and trees. Where animals feed and roam, safe in a forest home. Sharing with the bugs, the birds and the bees. Where? Hello, I'm Spat. Trees provide shelter for many birds and animals. Tawny Owl The Tawny Owl builds its nest in the sheltered part of the oak tree. Fungus Fungus can grow overnight if it has rained. It is the food insects and slugs love. Badgers. Badgers live under the oak tree. Bluebells. Bluebells need space and sunlight to grow. Red squirrel. Red squirrels usually live near Scots pine trees. Scottish crossbill. The Scottish crossbill eats pine cones. Ants. Ants make their nests from pine needles. Capercaillie. The capercaillie builds its nest at the bottom of a Scots pine tree. Gallery. Capercaillie. Red Squirrel Bluebell Tawny Owl Badger Sparrowhawk Pine Martin 
Lady Dio. Click and drag each living thing to its home in the wood. Ants. Capricaly. Bluebell. Tawny Owl. Fungus. Red Squirrel. Badgers. Scottish Crossbill. Fantastic! You got them all right! When? Hello, I'm Mr. P. Click on each season to see how this tree changes. Spring. Summer. Autumn. Winter. Most deciduous trees drop their leaves in autumn and start to grow new leaves in spring. All year to see what happens all year round. This is an evergreen tree. Click on each season to see what happens. Spring. Summer. Autumn. Winter. Most evergreen trees have green needles and they keep them all year, so they're green forever. Click all year to see what happens all year round. What does this deciduous tree look like in autumn? Great! Well done! In autumn, the leaves are starting to fall. What does this deciduous tree look like in summer? Great! Well done! In summer, a deciduous tree has lots of leaves. What does this deciduous tree look like in spring? Great! Well done! In spring, a deciduous tree is starting to grow new leaves. What does this deciduous tree look like in winter? Great! Well done! In winter, a deciduous tree has no leaves on it. This is an oak leaf and acorn from an oak tree. An oak leaf has a wavy line all around it. Grey squirrels like to eat acorns. The Scots pine tree has green needles and pine cones. Red squirrels like to eat the seeds from the pine cones. Gallery Oak tree and acorn Scots pine tree and pine cone Horse chestnut and conquer Hazel tree and hazelnut. Sycamore tree and sycamore leaf. Holly tree and holly leaf. Why? Hello, I'm Nikki. 
Dead trees are really important to forest life. Let's find out who uses this dead tree. Sparrowhawk. Some large birds use the dead tree as a lookout, and also for somewhere to eat the food they caught. Bats. Bats often use a hole that a woodpecker has made. Fungus. Fungus is a type of plant that lives on dead trees. It feeds on the rotting wood. Some are poisonous. Millipedes. Millipedes live on the ground. They feed on dead leaves. Beetles. Beetles make long tunnels under the bark of the tree. Woodpecker. The woodpecker uses the dead tree to find food, like insects, and to hammer out holes for his nest. That's great! You found all the hot spots. Help the beetle escape from the woodpecker. Every time you get a correct answer, the beetle moves one step closer to its den. If you get an answer wrong, the woodpecker moves one step closer to the beetle. Click on some fungus. Well done! The beetle is on its way home. Click on a millipede. Well done! The beetle is nearly home. Click on some dead leaves. Great! The beetle is very close to home. Click on the creature that uses the tree as a lookout. Fantastic! The beetle is home and safe from the woodpecker. <laughs> what does a millipede like to eat? Dead leaves, bluebells, pine icons. Dead leaves. Well done. The beetle is on its way home. <laughs> what does a beetle do under the bark of the tree? Make tunnels, spin a web, eat leaves. Make tunnels. Well done. The beetle is nearly home. Are fungi poisonous? All. Some. None. Some. Great. The beetle is very close to home. What does the sparrow hawk use the dead tree for? A lookout, storing pine icons, to hammer out a nest. A lookout. Fantastic! The beetle is home and safe from the woodpecker. <laughs> What an amazing sight, the wonders of forest life. A living world of plants and flowers and trees. Where animals feed and roam, safe in a forest home. Sharing with the bugs, the birds and the bees.